craziest games I've seen all season. Uh, have you ever been in a, in a game like that before and with, with such, uh, such big implications? Um, we had some close, but I mean nothing compares to playing for the district final and the feeling that you get when you're in 13. such a close game. So, I mean, there's nothing compared to just being in that moment. Especially at such a big court at Fitchburg State. It's crazy. Yeah, I know um, not a lot of people have gotten the chance to see you two play before. Did you sort of relish the opportunity? You know, Fitchburg State, big crowd, everybody out to watch you guys? Um, yeah, I mean, we don't really care who's watching us. We just know we have to play. Like, people are going to come watch us. I mean, it doesn't matter. As long as we play our game, we don't care who's here. This if you could both just talk about uh, what it means to you guys to win the Division Three title, uh, you know, big time underdog, uh, probably weren't predicted at the beginning of the season, but you guys made that run, you know, pulled it out in overtime. Um, I think it's, it means so much to us. We worked so hard, even last year. Um, we're all seniors, so it was pretty much this or go home. We knew that we had to take advantage of this. Um, I think we deserved it. We worked hard. A lot of people under, underestimated us, thinking, oh, they weren't that good, they play lower schools, but I think tonight we showed everyone who we really were. You trailed a lot of the game, uh, you know, not by much, but um, what were you guys thinking, you know, coming down the stretch there, and did you, did you feel like you could close the gap, and, and uh, you know, obvious, obviously you did. Yeah, um, we knew we just had to keep, um, keep our composure and not worry, like, everyone's going to go on the run, it just happens in basketball, so we had to know when to, like, stop the run and the run and the just, and just, we knew that our run was going to come at some point in the game, we just had to just take the opportunity. Luckily it was at the end of the game instead of the beginning. Yeah. yeah. And uh, I think I think it was like 63 points between you guys. Can you just talk about the the way your games sort of fit together? Um, we've played with each other for a long time. AAU all summer. We know exactly how each other plays, and we knew that 
us together and using our team, obviously. Nobody can stop us. Last week, could you guys just talk about that overtime and uh, how dramatic it was? And it seemed, Aretha, it seemed like you had the mindset to just just go go to the hoop every time you got it. And and I know Sam, you had a, a ton of really big steals for you guys. Yeah. Um, my team was just to go. We knew they were in foul trouble, so just go and attack them and just see what you can get from it. Um, either it's going to be a layup or a foul, so that's what we were just trying to do. Trying to just push the ball. Yeah. And Sam, can you talk about the overtime and what your your mindset was there? Um, my mind was going crazy, but I knew that this is it, and this is what I've been waiting for all year. So I was just kind of focused on doing what I knew how to do best and keeping my team up and going for the win.